the Grumman F-9F Panther was the manufacturer's first jet fighter and one of the United States Navy's first successful carrier-based jet fighters. A single-engined, straight-winged day fighter, it was fitted with an armament of 420mm cannons and could carry a wide assortment of air-to-ground munitions. The Panther was used extensively by the U.S. Navy and the United States Marine Corps in the Korean War. It was also the first jet aircraft used by the Blue Angels flight team, being used by them from 1949 through to late 1954. The aircraft was exported to Argentina and was the first jet used by the Argentine Naval Aviation. Total F-9F production was 1,382. The design evolved into the swept-wing Grumman F-9 Cougar. Design and Development Development studies at the Grumman Company for jet-powered fighter aircraft began near the end of World War II as the first jet engines emerged. In a competition for a jet-powered night fighter for the United States Navy, the Douglas XF-3D-1 was selected over Grumman Aircraft Engineering Corporation's G-75 two-seat, four Westinghouse J-30 powered design, with Douglas being issued a contract on April 3, 1946. The U.S. Navy's Bureau of Aeronautics also issued a contract to Grumman for two model G-75 experimental aircraft on April 11, 1946 being given the Navy designation XF-9F1, in case the Skik Knight ran into problems. Grumman soon realized the G-75 was a losing design but had been working on a completely different, single-engine day fighter known as the Grumman G-79. Due to some interesting bureaucracy, BUA did not cancel the G-75 contract but changed the wording to include three entirely different G-79 prototypes. The G-79 became the Grumman F-9F Panther. The prototype Panther, piloted by test pilot Corky Mayer, first flew on November 21, 1947. American engines available at the time included the Allison J-33 and Westinghouse J-34, but these were not considered sufficiently reliable, so the Navy specified the imported Rolls-Royce Neen turbojet, which was also more powerful at 5,000 pounds of thrust. Production aircraft would have a Neen engine built under license by Pratt & Whitney as the J-42. Since there was insufficient space within the wings and fuselage for fuel for the thirsty jet, permanently mounted wingtip fuel tanks were added, which incidentally improved the fighter's rate of roll. It was cleared for flight from aircraft carriers in September 1949. During the development phase, Grumman decided to change the Panther's engine. Selecting the Pratt & Whitney J-48P2, a license-built version of the Rolls-Royce rb 44 t The other engine that had been tested was the Allison J-33A-16. The armament was a quartet of 20mm guns, the Navy having already switched to this caliber. As well, the Panther soon was armed with underwing air-to-ground rockets and up to 2,000 pounds of bombs. From 1946, a swept-wing version was considered and after concerns about the Panther's inferiority to its MiG opponents in Korea, a conversion of the Panther resulted in a swept-wing derivative of the Panther, the F-9F Cougar, which retained the Panther's designation number. Operational history equals U.S. Navy equals The Grumman Panther was the primary U.S. Navy and USMC jet fighter and ground attack aircraft in the Korean War. The Panther was the most widely used U.S. Navy jet fighter of the Korean War, flying 78,000 sorties and scoring the first air-to-air -air kill by the U.S. Navy in the war, the downing of a North Korean Yakovlev Yak-9 fighter. F-9F-2s, F-9F-3s and F-9F-5s, as rugged attack aircraft, were able to sustain operations, even in the face of intense anti-aircraft fire. The pilots also appreciated the air-conditioned cockpit, which was a welcome change from the humid environment of piston-powered aircraft. Despite their relative slow speed, Panthers also managed to shoot down two Yak-9s and seven Mikway and Gurevic MiG-15s for the loss of two F-9Fs. On July 3, 1950, Lieutenant, Junior Great Leonard H. Plogg of U.S. Navy's VF-51 flying an F-9F-3 scored the first U.S. Navy air victory of the war by shooting down a Yak-9. 
The first MiG-15 was downed on November 9, 1950 by Lieutenant Commander William A. Men of VF-111 Sundowners Squadron flying an F-9F-2B. Two more MiG-15s were downed on November 18, 1950. The final four MiG-15s were downed on November 18, 1952 by Lieutenant Royce Williams of VF-781, flying off the carrier Oriskany during a series of airstrikes against the North Korean port of Horolong, right across the mouth of the Tumen River from the major Soviet base at Vladivostok. Williams' victories were notable because all four were flown by Soviet naval aviation pilots. In 1992, Russian authorities admitted that Captains Belyakov and Bandolov, and Lieutenants Poklomkin and Tarshinov were lost on November 18, 1952. Information regarding this fight had been suppressed by the U.S. Navy at the time because personnel of the then new National Security Agency had been involved in the intercept, and U.S. authorities were concerned that the Soviets might learn of this if the affair was publicized. No other fighter pilot ever scored four MiG-15s in a single combat. Future astronaut Neil Armstrong flew the F-9F extensively during the war, even ejecting from one of the aircraft when it was brought down by a wire strung across a valley. Future astronaut John Glenn and Boston Red Sox All-Star baseball player Ted Williams also flew the F-9F as Marine Corps pilots. Panthers were withdrawn from frontline service in 1956, but remained in training roles and with U.S. Naval Air Reserve and U.S. Marine Air Reserve units until 1958. The Navy's Blue Angels flight demonstration team used the Panther for four years, beginning in 1951. The Panther was the Blue Angels' first jet. Some Panthers continued to serve in small numbers into the 1960s. From September 1962 surviving operational Panthers were redesignated F-9 within the new combined U.S. Tri-Service Designation System. Equals Argentine Navy equals, the only foreign buyer of the Panther was the Argentine Naval Aviation, which bought 28 ex-USN F-9 F-2B aircraft in 1957. The first 10 arrived in 1958. Only 24 aircraft were put in service, the rest was used as spares. The first flight of an Argentine Panther was in December 1958, and the last aircraft was put in service in January 1961. The catapults on the then only Argentine carrier, ARA Independencia, were considered not powerful enough to launch the F-9F, so the aircraft were land-based. However, in July 1963 a Panther landed on the Independencia as part of trials becoming the first jet to land on an Argentine aircraft carrier. Argentine Navy F-9 F-2 Panthers saw combat in the 1963 Argentine Navy Revolt, bombing and strafing a column of the Army 8th Tank Regiment which was advancing on the rebelling base era naval punt Indio. The attack destroyed several M4 Sherman tanks, at the cost of one F-9 F Panther shot down. The Argentine Panthers were involved in the general mobilization during the 1965 border clash between Argentina and Chile but no combat occurred. They were taken out of service in 1969 due to the lack of spare parts and replaced with Douglas A4Q Skyhawks. The Argentine Navy operated the Grumman F-9 Cougar as well. Variants XF-9 F-2, the first two prototypes, XF-9 F-3, the third prototype, F-9F2, first production version, powered by Pratt & Whitney J-42 engine. F-9F2B, version fitted with underwing racks for bombs and rockets. All F-9F2s were eventually so modified, and the B designation was dropped. F-9F2P, unarmed photographic reconnaissance version used in Korea. F-9F3, Allison J-33 powered version produced as insurance against the failure of the J-42, 54 built. All converted to J-42 power later. XF-9F4, prototype used in the development of the F-9F4. F-9F4, version with longer fuselage with greater fuel load and powered by J-33 engine. Most re-engined with J-42S. F-9F4s were the first aircraft to successfully employ blown air, extracted from between the engine's compressor and combustion chambers, to energize the slot flaps, thus achieving a decrease in stalling speed of 9 kn for takeoff and 7 kn on power approach for landing. 
F9F5, variant of F9F4, but powered by Pratt and Whitney J48 engine, 616 built. F9F5P, unarmed photo reconnaissance version, 36 built, longer nose. F9F5K, after the F9F Panther was withdrawn operational service, a number of F9F5s were converted into unmanned target drone aircraft. F9F5KD, as drone directors for the F9F5K drones. Redesignated DF9E in 1962. Operators, Argentina, Argentine Navy, Argentine Naval Aviation, United States, United States Navy, United States Marine Corps. Survivors. Equals Argentina equals, on display. F9F2B. 041-3A106, Gate Guardian at Puerto Belgrano Naval Base at Baja Blanca, Argentina. 0425-3A113, being restored at Argentine Naval Aviation Museum at Baja Blanca, Argentina. 0452-3A111, Gate Guardian at Punta Indio Naval Air Base near La Plata, Argentina. 0453-3A118, displayed at National Naval Museum at Tigre, Argentina. Equals United States equals, Airworthy. F9F2B. 123,078 Cavanaugh Flight Museum in Addison, Texas. On display. F9F2. 123,050, National Naval Aviation Museum in NAS Pensacola, Florida, 123,557, VFW Post 1621 in Janesville, Wisconsin. 123,612. NAS Oceana Air Park, Virginia. 123,652, Flying Leatherneck Aviation Museum, MCAS Miramar, California. 125,183, Palmer Air and Space Museum, adjacent to Davis Mongan AFB in Tucson, Arizona. 127,120, Wings of Freedom Aviation Museum in Horsham, Pennsylvania. F9F2B. 123,526, National Museum of the Marine Corps, adjacent to Marine Corps Base Quantico and Triangle, Virginia. F9F4. 125,180, Lions Park in Costa Mesa, California. F9F5. Bureau Number Unknown, USS Midway Museum in San Diego, California. 125,295. Valiant Air Command Warbird Museum at Space Coast Regional Airport in Titusville, Florida, 126,226, Combat Air Museum in Topeka, Kansas, 126,275, Battleship Memorial Park in Mobile, Alabama, F-9F-5P, 126,277, The Air Museum, Plains of Fame, in Chino, California. Under restoration or in storage. F9F2. 123,054, under restoration at Yanks Air Museum in Chino, California. 123,092, in storage for restoration at USS John F. Kennedy Museum in North Kingston, Rhode Island. 123,420, in storage at Fantasy of Flight in Polk City, Florida. F9F5. 125,467, in storage by Dale James in Balverde, Texas. Specifications. Data from, general characteristics, crew, 1, length, 37 feet 5 inches, wingspan, 38 feet 0 in, height, 11 feet 4 in, wing area, 250 FTA squared, empty weight, 9,303 pounds, Loaded weight, 14,235 pounds, max takeoff weight, 16,450 pounds, power plant, 1A, Pratt & Whitney J42P6-P8 turbojet, 5,950 pound forces with water injection, performance, maximum speed, 500 kn, range, 1,300 miles, service ceiling, 44,600 feet, 
rate of climb, 5,140 feet per minute, wing loading, 71 pounds FTA squared, thrust weight, 0.42, armament, guns, 4 20 mm M2 cannon, 190 RPG, hardpoints, underwing hardpoints and provisions to carry combinations of, rockets 6 a, 5 in rockets on underwing hardpoints, bombs, 2,000 pounds of bombs. Notable appearances in media, the Panther played a prominent role in the 1954 movie Men of the Fighting Lady. The F-9F was also featured in the flying sequences in the 1954 movie The Bridges at Tokori, although in the 1953 James A. Michael novel upon which the movie was based, the main character flew a McDonnell F-2H Banshee. See also, Related Development, Grumman F-9 Cougar, Grumman XF-10F Jaguar, Aircraft of Comparable Role, Configuration and Era, Hawker Seahawk, McDonnell F-2H Banshee. Related lists, list of fighter aircraft, list of military aircraft of the United States, list of military aircraft of the United States. References. Equals notes equals. Equals bibliography equals. Equals online sources equals. Psychology, Juan Carlos. Rivas, Santiago. Grumman Panther en Argentina, Grumman Panther in Argentina. Instituto Aero Naval. Articulos, Historia. Instituto Aero Naval. Retrieved August 28, 2014. Carlos May. Casa Bombardier de la Aviación Naval, Grumman F 9F 2 Panther, Naval Aviation Fighter Bombers, Grumman F 9F 2 Panther. His Tama, Historia y Arqueología Maritima. Fundación His Tama. Retrieved August 29, 2014. Further reading, Mayer, Cohen. Grumman F9F Panther Part 1 A Euro Development, Testing, Structures. Naval Fighters NAR 59. California, United States, Ginter Books. ISBN 0-942612-59-0. Retrieved January 31, 2015. Ginter, Steve. Grumman F9F Panther Part 2 A Euro USMC Panthers. Naval Fighters Now 60. California, United States, Ginter Books. ISBN 0 942612 60 4. Retrieved January 31, 2015. Ginter, Steve. Grumman F9F Panther Part 3 A Euro Navy Panthers. Naval Fighters Now 61. California, United States, Ginter Books. ISBN 0-942612-61-2. Retrieved January 31, 2015. Now a plus or minus is Padden, Jorge Felix. Now a plus or minus is Padden, Jorge Felix, ed. Grumman F9F Panther and Cougar. Sierra Naval 29. Baja Blanca. Argentina, Fights as Aaron Avails. ISBN 978-987-1682-03-4. Retrieved August 26, 2014. External links, U.S. Navy Naval Aviation News article on the F-9F Panther, the Grumman F-9F Panther Cougar at Air Vectors.